Hey guys, what's up? This is Sean Heather and in this video we are going to perform a benchmarking test comparison between Huawei Mate 10 and Huawei Mate 10 Pro smartphones. Both of these devices, they are pretty much identical in terms of hardware specs. The only difference is that Huawei Mate 10 comes with a WQHD screen, Mate 10 Pro comes with a Full HD screen and Mate 10 Pro got 6 GB RAM and 128 GB internal storage while Huawei Mate 10 it got 4 GB RAM and 64 GB internal storage. The Android version, the Emotion UI version, the processor, GPU, everything else is similar in both of these devices. So the benchmarking applications we got today here, they are Android benchmarking, Basemark OS 2, Basemark X, Geekbench 4 and Quadrant Standard. We have already performed all of these benchmarking tests to save you time and we will have a look directly on the benchmarking test scores and we will compare the result with respect to each other. So let's just start it. So first of all let's just start with Quadrant Standard. So here we go with the scores. Huawei Mate 10 it has scored 42,986 it's nearly 43,000 and here our Mate 10 Pro it got 40,313 so as you can see that in this test the winner is Huawei Mate 10 now let's have a look on Android benchmarking one of the most popular benchmarking application and here we go so as you can see that Huawei Mate 10 scored 175,775 and Mate 10 Pro scored 178,859. So performance of Mate 10 Pro is better compared to Huawei Mate 10 and you can give the credit to more RAM and more internal storage compared to Huawei Mate 10. And if you go to this screen you can compare the individual test scores. So you can see that in 3D graphics performance of Mate 10 Pro is slightly better also in UX and also in CPU and RAM as well but as you can see there is not much difference between CPU scores and also in the UX but when it comes to 3D graphics and RAM the difference is a bit more and that's why Mate 10 Pro got overall better score compared to Huawei Mate 10. So let's go back from here let's have a look on Base Mark OS 2. here we go so Huawei Mate 10 scored 3253 and Mate 10 Pro scored 3177 so as you can see this time the winner is Huawei Mate 10 and if you have a look on the individual test scores in system performance of Mate 10 is slightly better compared to Mate 10 Pro for memory the winner is Mate 10 Pro for graphics the winner is Huawei Mate 10 this time and for web browsing as you can see the score is pretty much same the only difference is of one point in Mate 10 Pro but our main concern is the overall score and in that performance of Huawei Mate 10 is slightly better now let's have a look on Basemark X it's a gaming benchmarking test so basically it gives the idea about the performance of GPU and here we go so as you can see here that Mate 10 Pro scored 43,710 and Mate 10 scored 44,775. So in this test as well the winner is Huawei Mate 10 and you can also watch our Huawei Mate 10 gaming review video to get the idea that how good the device performs while playing few of the most high end games on it. And now let's have a look. Geekbench 4 the last test for today and this one is divided in two parts here we go with the CPU so for single core as you can see the winner is Huawei Mate 10 Pro and also for the multi core and if you go back from here and go to the compute in compute again the winner is Huawei Mate 10 Pro compared to Mate 10 though the difference is not so much but still the winner is Huawei Mate 10 Pro so as we have seen in 
all of these benchmarking test scores and out of 5 in 3 tests, Benchmark OS 2, Benchmark X and Quadrant Standard, performance of Huawei Mate 10 was better and in Android Benchmarking and Geekbench 4, performance of Huawei Mate 10 Pro was better. But both of these devices, they are exactly same in terms of hardware specs. As I said, the only difference is in terms of RAM. And that's why they are scoring pretty much similar benchmarking scores compared to each other. So if you're going to buy any of these two devices, you will be totally satisfied with the performance because both of them, they are going to perform similar to each other. The only difference you will find most of the time, basically it's uh, in the design and visual appearance. So that's all for now friends, thanks for watching the video and do not forget to subscribe the channel for more videos, tips and tricks, enhance on videos like this. I'll see you guys next time in another video, have a nice day.